Good morning from Walt Disney World, everybody. Don't know if I, I mentioned to you, but uh, Fort Wilderness Campground here, we are in Magic Kingdom. This actual campground is inside the park. So, <laughs> this morning I'm just hanging out with Jax until we get back into it. Uh, Epcot today. We're gonna go explore, but first we gotta start off with like a really good breakfast. So I'm hungry. Need some park food. Sound good? Oh, you want some kibbles? Oh, okay. But one of the perks to going to the campground is we get to take our pets with us and they're not in a boarding house somewhere that we can't see them. I get to see Jax as often as I want and I can come back and visit halfway throughout the day if I want to. Right, Jax? Oh, okay. And yes, transportation is really easy getting around the campground and getting to the depot so we can go to the parks. This is where the uh, Trails End restaurant is at, at the end of the settlement here. Ooh, frontier fixin' and friendly folk. Ready for some good old home cooking. Mm. Off to Epcot. And welcome to Epcot, everybody. All right, since we're already over in this area, let's check out Finding Nemo. Fine. Fine, 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 Mmm. Try Beverly here. That's my new favorite, actually. This part of the park is very not busy. Crazy. Okay, I'm just gonna give away the secret. I bought some tickets for the candlelight processional. Uh, which includes food at one time and then an actual view of the candlelight processional later tonight. Here, just so you know. The Grand Fiesta. Should we go check this one out? It's like a boat cruise. Oh, Coco. So we're going to try a flight of beers here. We got the White Christmas first, the Central 28 Favorite Things Brown Ale, and the Cold Brew Coffee Lager here on the end. Might want to try the Cider Flight also. 
All right, round two on the flights. Pomegranate, black currant, and some apple cider here. Just tiny beers so far. Here we are in Germany land here in Epcot. Ooh, the Carmel Coochie. Got some visitors behind me, but one thing I always do at Disney is get the souvenir $10 popcorn thing because for the length of your stay in any park, it's only $2 to refill this. That's a great little snack. Comes with a lid, can throw it on the backpack, eat while you're in line or something. Oh, and I'm trying the Budweiser Copper Lager here. Does that look tasty? I think this guy wants some. Here we are in Italy. Guess where we're eating lunch? That's right. The Napoli. Love those pizza ovens. That's awesome. There we go. Can you tell which half is mine? <laughs> pizza was good. I am trying the Kentucky Bourbon Ale here. Mm hmm. And that's a good one too. Come back to Epcot World Showcase because our fast pass for Frozen expires. Heading over there now. There we go. Fast pass. Fast pass. pass for test track. Wait time is 40 minutes. We're going to try it now. is super fast, way fun, and it's only 10 minutes on the single line. <laughs> There's Ralph. Next up, Soren. We gotta have an early dinner because we got this included with candlelight procession tickets later. So we'll go in here first. There's Mr. Sharky. Hmm, look at you. Let's see, do they have shark on the menu here? Appetizer is clam chowder. Went with steak and mashed potatoes. I'm stuffed. Oh, I saved room though. Chocolate wave cake. Mm -hmm. Ah, you pesky monorail. I will ride you one day. <laughs> wow.
really awesome show. Going to head for the exit and see if Spaceship Earth has a short line. Gonna skip illuminations because I'm gonna see fireworks in Magic Kingdom in a couple days. So had fun in Epcot though. Still time, five minute waits. <laughs> Alright, Epcot, goodbye and good night. We'll see you next year. Just gonna wait for my bus ride home. Go check in on Jax. <laughs> Hopefully get some sleep for another start in the morning. Thanks for joining me guys. I'll catch you in a couple days. Bye-bye.